Hi guys, it's Elle here to do a collective reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It is much appreciated. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's go ahead and jump into this. Thank you, Lord God, for blessing the collective with a message this day. Let it be true. Let it be clear and concise from you. Amen. Okay, so the card, the message that I'm getting just off the cards pull, and we'll pull more cards. Um, somebody interfered with a family dynamic, family connection. Whether you were married to this person or not, it was like long standing, okay? Um, somebody really did heavy duty interference in this. They messed up this family dynamic. They, even it was all for selfish gain, or it's for selfish gain. This person is out to get you fill in the blank. There could be someone who is wealthy, well off, or they they married well. For some of you, someone is interfering in the connection, or they already have interfered. This could have, uh, uh, this interference could have started as like, um, someone started a new sexual connection with somebody. They were already married or coupled or whatever. They lived together, had a family, or uh, were planning to do that with a particular someone. And this new sexual relationship experience came about. And this person lost their mind. Um, this new relationship overshadowed the fact that they had a family and they had legacy. And... Um, and that they should have been loyal to and dedicated, devoted to, you know, seeing the legacy through. So this person, um, right now, they're in some karmic type of connection with this outside individual. It looks like they could be understanding that it is now karmic because... The relationship is now coming up as the Ten of Wands. So something is heavy duty, just burdensome. It's no longer fun. What am I doing this for? Where am I going? What am I getting out of it? I'm, I'm exerting so much force, so much energy with little to no return. It's like this relationship started and somebody didn't have a plan for it they didn't see a plan for this person they didn't have a plan for what you know or a course of action that you would take you know in relationship like we're going to move in together we're going to get married we're going to do this different milestones none of that is happening if it's not happening it's not happening um if it is happening it's not happening by way of this person wanting it it's just everything being thrown at them all at once. And, and this somebody's not sure. The person who left their family is not sure if they even want this anymore. Because something has become taxing, burdensome. Somebody was swayed away from their marital partner because somebody wanted a sexy wife. Or they wanted someone that they could show off. They wanted someone who was hot, who was maybe younger, more fun. But now, in getting this person, somebody's realizing this is a lot of work. I don't know if I have the energy to keep going. I don't know where it's going. I just feel like I'm, I'm showing up to this relationship every day and I just don't know what we're doing i don't know how long how much longer i can last in this somebody's cracking under the own the, under uh, the weight of their own doing somebody just took on a situation and didn't know that it was going to be this burdens burdensome someone is definitely out to get something to take whether it's super malicious 
if there's some diabolical plan, I don't know. But it definitely is someone who is not interested in reciprocating and giving back. They're here to take. As long as you're giving, I will take. This is what someone is doing. And someone, again, is in despair, grief, agony. Because something didn't turn out the way they thought. Something has been lost. Somebody feels like something was taken from them. Maybe their joy, their freedom, their vigor, their zest for life. Something is gone. They're in great despair also because they feel like they can't go backwards to maybe a person they left, to a dynamic they left, to a situation. Not exactly sure. Somebody feels stuck, bound, tied to, restricted, confined in their mind, physically, however, but they're definitely feeling like this was my own doing. This is the door I walked in and now I feel trapped. I feel stuck. I feel imprisoned. And this is a this is a lot of work. This relationship is a lot of work, says someone. It's too hard. It's it's supposed to be easier. It used to be fun. It used to be jovial. It used to be sexy. It used to be adventurous. And now it's just taxing. Someone could be spending up a lot of someone else's money or they have all these grandiose plans in terms of what they want, how they want it. Someone wants to backtrack. They want to go back, but they just don't know how to go back to. Right, someone wants to send a message, an unexpected message of wanting a new start with a particular someone that they're estranged from, right? Because you can't want a new start with someone you're already with or you, you already have. So someone wants a new start for someone who is independent from this connection now, someone who has gotten out of the connection. There's a man in deep concern about will this person allow me back? Will this person have me back? They're greatly concerned about, is there still room? Is there still opportunity? They're analyzing what's really going on in their lives. And now they're putting things in perspective. Because Neptune is um, retrograde and Pisces. So now the veil of illusion and watery feelings and um, peaches and creams and... Uh, and uh, you know, uh, just all of these, uh, the rose-colored glasses are being removed from all of our eyes. So now we are prompted to make real-life, realistic decisions about what's really going on. This is so crazy. I mean, every card I choose, it follows the story. Someone wanted a sexy wife. And someone wanted a rich husband. Someone left their... They left their tried and true. They left the person that they may have even had children with or built a life with. Or they're, if they haven't left them, then they're definitely checked out of the connection. Because they're focused on... Um, Starting something else. Or they're focused on this other person, this other relationship, but they're also having a lot of regrets about it. Someone was focused, someone got swayed away also from if you weren't married to this person, it was you guys could have been life partners, soulmates or twin flames or something of that nature. And here comes Mr. or Mrs. Sexy. And they kind of shifted that the dynamic into where that person was more focused outside of the connection. Not focused on the person that was their soulmate, could be their life partner, but focused on the other, this Mr. Sexy, Mrs. Sexy. And now it's just, they're at a place of like, why did I do it? Someone is really asking the question, why did I do that? Someone wants to be tied to, again, that person who is independent from the connection now. The person who is on the outside now. 
will you have my baby? Somebody wants a significant tie to this person, but there, some of them are still at a place of where they just can't choose. This is someone who, this could also be someone who had a hard time leaving the single life, the singlehood, just couldn't see themselves getting married or just doing the traditional thing. So they decided to pacify their person with maybe money. I give you money, that should be enough. It, but this person still decided to leave because it wasn't enough and now they're missing that person missing you and they really want to marry you but at the same time they want to be single or this could now be the other person saying I, um, I want to be single because being with you um, I would never get enough or I wouldn't get what I need Someone has put, I think this person independent to the connection on a high, on give them high honor, on a pedestal. And they they dream to be with this person and they're trying to get more solid and stable within themselves, within spirituality, so that they can actually be with this mature woman. Maybe even try to present her with a gift of some sort or someone is actually seeing the gift that is the mature woman but this woman that they are in a courtship with or, or the woman on the outside the number two woman could be making it hard for someone could want to get married to this person quickly because a rich husband is what they, they're after. And someone feels like if he marries this woman, I'm going to be, you know, in a state of poverty. This woman will definitely not look out for me and my children or me or the responsibilities that are, that um, this man could have had before. definitely a material girl or a guy here somebody is definitely materialistic all about what they can get what they can have there's a situation of I don't know ex-wife baby's baby's mom or something of that nature where somebody's making it hard for the other person to move forward yeah they're making it hard for the other person to move forward. They're causing a lot of drama in this person's life. Life and they, uh, the people around them and their significant other is seeing this. But they're saying, look, I, I love you. Or there's an element of somebody saying, I love you. Back to the story of maybe the husband being swayed away from the wife or the main person. Um, someone is saying I love you and I would choose you they think that you're actually beautiful you're absolutely beautiful they want you to work with them because maybe they have some addictions that you don't know about wow as I say that I have things I, have things I haven't told you and they're very insecure This other woman could be after the, your person's fortune, okay? Or this man or woman is after somebody's fortune. They're false altogether. Expect the unexpected. Expect a message coming to you that's going to be very concerning. You're expecting something to happen around your twin flame or soulmate 
maybe for them to have a change of heart for all of a sudden they'll come to you and understand this twin flame soulmate journey understand the nature of your relationship how important it is because right now they can't see what's really going on here because they're caught up in somebody's spell lies someone could want to return to you they cheated in the past and now they're saying um i'm faithfully yours cheated in the past and i'm faithfully yours now they could be leaving a situation they haven't told you their true intentions, but they want you to wait for them. Because they feel like you're just right for them. There's somebody dealing with some heavy burdens in terms of what they caused for themselves. Walking away from... What was beautiful, the legacy, the empire, the longevity, the life partner to go to um, someone who was sexy, sex worker, someone has a sexual addiction, I don't know. There's an energy if some of you are not going to take this person back or you're really going to make it hard for them because you, you feel like this person broke your heart. They cause the division. They cause the the alienation, the isolation. Um, they were a part of it, and even now that they want you back and they're seeing the error of their way, I don't know if you're for it. They may even try to come to you, reason with you, and you may have the power now in this dynamic. They may try to gift you or give you money or show you their affection by way of money. You and somebody else, especially with those cards of I would choose you, I can't choose. This other woman, man, serves a whole nother purpose for this person. It is just an emotional, maybe even sexual, materialistic um, attachment that they have towards this person. This person knows that they hurt you. Yeah, you could be dealing with um, someone who gets a lot of attention, who's very sexy, um, business owner, delegates well, but but hides, hides and masquerades behind um, his words, uses his words wisely. Someone who. Internally, they really must want to walk through life alone or with very few attachments. All of a sudden, this person, yeah, they feel in love though. For you, they want their family back. They want to call it, call it, they want to call a truce. They want to come back. They want to restore. They want to renew. They want to get back on the right path. They want to clear the slate, clean the slate. They want a second chance because somebody is seeing. Someone's had some psychic downloads also. Intuitive dreams, downloads in terms of what another person, this person on the outside means to them, right? This person may even be living up to the fact that maybe they caused all the drama. They are the reason for the ending. But they want the connection back. And you are all that they can think of. They've gotten really clear on who is most dependable, reliable. Wow. They're trying to be strong enough to walk away. Right. Move their life in a more positive direction. Because they do have a singular love for someone they've had a long-term relationship with someone who 
where there's been a you know a period of stagnation, maybe nine months or something like that, of of no talking, of inactivity, nine weeks, nine months. There's been some time where that has elapsed, and this person is still waiting for the opportunity to come back to reconcile because they're seeing something differently. They've got a perspective change. They may have even gone and worked on themselves. They, they are suffering a lot of regret and remorse. If someone just left you out of the blue, they want to return, apologize, make it right. They're going to say all the right things. They have gone on the self-discovery journey here. They understand that they can't keep playing two fields. I'm playing on two fields. They could possibly want to come back to you, sweep you off your feet, make you fall in love with them. You guys talk about how to build a life together. They feel like their best energy, their best efforts were or are with you. Wow, this came out. Forgive me. Because they're with a the gold digger. You can't make this shit up. And maybe this person is very manipulative. Your person, the person they're with, everybody's manipulative. But it looks like your person may be saying, look, I'm maturing. I was immature. I am a drama king or queen or I am with one. And, wow, I can't make it up. And being with you is just awesome. This is like a... A story of not knowing what you really have until you lose it. Somebody wants the connection back because where they are, who they're with, is not fulfilling them. They're still, for some of you, not at a place of choosing, making an actual choice and deciding. Um, but they do want to come to you and restore. I, I think this person just wants to even have the opportunity to talk to you while wow, they want to bring the marriage back or they want to marry you. We saw that earlier in the cards. But they're focused on their money, their occupation, on growing something. Wow. They see you as the one. Again, this person, time apart from you, for them to see what they actually have in other people, or one other person has really matured them. This card wanted to fall on the floor. Let's see. Right. Not being around their family. Not being able to talk to you. Be in intimate contact. Relationship with people. Trusted individuals. Um, has got them in a place of wanting to change. And be better. Be best, like your former first lady. Wow, this person says, I'm not happy. This is crazy. I'm so sorry I was an idiot. I dream about you. Please give me another chance. You are marriage material. Yes, I was or am dating other people. And I was a cheat or a cheater. But this person wants you back. If this message resonates where you go over to the website book there, um, take advantage of the text question where you can text the question to the number below. You can also donate to the channel if you're feeling moved to do so. This is a collective reading. It's just the energy that it was channeled. Um, it could be for you. It could not be for you. Um, if it fits, it fits. If it doesn't, that's okay too. Uh, take care all. Many blessings to you. All links are in the description box.